Hello there, this is Andre Roberts here from Synthify.co.uk, best place to find Android, tablet, PCs and accessories. What I'm going to be doing today is giving a little bit of a demo on how to access your movies and pictures on the Android tablet PC. Now the one that I'm using is the Synthmoney Licorice 7-inch tablet PC and how to access your movies first of all is to insert your, SIM, your SD card. I've got mine inserted just here. Let me take it out for you so you can see. There you go. Size of this one is a nice little 4 gig there. Got it in the middle of the access port there so you can just plug that in. One second, there you go. Once you hear the click, nice and snug, nice and flush, and you know it's in. Okay. Now once you pull it in you'll see it comes up with the media scanning there. That's a very good sign to show you that the device is reading the data on there and making sure it's ready for you to access. First thing you need to do is to go to the little icon in the middle here that shows all the different tiles. You click that and then you go over to what is known as the gallery. Once you click the gallery then you'll see at the bottom loading new albums and photos and then you can start manipulating the data that's on it. Now the gallery, our devices anyway, the gallery accesses both the information on the SD card and the information on the device itself. Some very little bit, so you may need another application to do that, but this one, this into my licorice, absolutely fine. So let's see what movies we've got here, and I can show you. And there you go, so it's a very simple, very self-explanatory, just click through the movies that you want to see, and see how far it goes. Yes, I'm an avid Matrix fan, so live with it. <laughs> but yeah, on this device you've got your integrated controls up the top here. Volume controls. Okay. And if you wanted to manipulate the movie in any way, what you'd do is you'd normally just click the top, and then you've got your features down the bottom. So if I wanted to bring the volume down, let's say, just click it. Bring the volume down this way. Yep. Increase it again. Just click it again. And yes, all fair in love and war. <laughs> you can forward it, you can pause it if you want to. Oh, that's a pretty clever pause there. <laughs> so you can pause it if you want to. Let it continue. All the tracking, all the um, animation will be kept because this is a fairly quick device in terms of its processor. Also, you can seek it if you want to. You can jump forward and back as in how you wish to. Fairly nice and you know imagine using this on your train or your bus or you know whatsoever. Fairly good for accessing moves in your pictures. Now to show you how to get your pictures on this just press the back button here. Take you right back. Push again. There you go. I see your pictures down at the bottom there so you can click that. A very nice display of how to you know, access your images. You can, usually this will have like hundreds of different images there so you can scroll backwards and forth. We've only really got a grid of 12 so I'll just pick one at random. And you can just select it and then manipulate it as you want to with two fingers, doing the pinch zoom or with one. How do you manipulate the images that are on the device? What you can do is you can click the screen just as I've done there. You can start your slideshow, you can click the menu you can delete or do you know different things, share it or set as a backdrop if you wish to. You know, various different things. It's showing the pre logo of the previous company that we were, or the trading name that we were operating under. Okay. Now, another thing people ask is how do I copy these things onto my um, actual device from the SD card? Now, to do that, we prefer the application called ES File Explorer. This comes as standard with our devices with the Sintamani Licorice. Some may have a different file explorer or application explorer or something like that, something to that tone. You can download an application like a file explorer from the Android market, which is fairly simple to do. You just type in file explorer and then download it straight from there. Here I'm going to use the file explorer and just click that. Now, what you have to do, what you have to remember is that our devices recognize the trans flash that's inside the device already. Yeah? the 4 gig that's built into the device. Now for you to access anything else, it calls it by another folder. 
either SD card 1 or SD card 2 or TF flash. In this case, it's TF flash. So I'll just click that here. As you can see, we've got a number of different applications that are with, oh sorry, documents that are within the SD card and the matrix there for one that we were just watching and TDI wallpapers. I think I'll do a copy of an image there. I shall do the one that we looked at before. So as you can see there, I can click one that I like or that I want to copy and when I click it, I hold down. As I hold down, it gives me another series of options. And I can cut, copy, rename, delete, you know, fairly similar to what you do on a Windows computer. What I'm going to do here is I'm going to copy. And then I'm going to navigate back to where I wish the destination folder to be. So I'm going to go backwards and backwards again. And um, I want to drop it on the top level. So in this area here, if this is where I want to pull it, I can hold down in the middle. Oh, sorry, wrong thing. I can push the menu button. And I can show more. You can see different things there. You can see operations. Yep. And as I click operations, yes, that was a brief moment there. <laughs> as I click operations, you can see I can paste the, paste the document that I was copying in. So if I just click paste then it shows that it was copied successfully. Now this is on the device itself. Those eagle-eyed viewers out there would have noticed a small download arrow at the top there. That means that the, devi that the device is now downloading the document into its memory there. And then you can access it, you can click it, view it in different image browsers or gallery. Let's view it in the gallery that we were looking at before. And it loads it from what was downloaded. Let's give it a moment to read. Sometimes it can take a moment because when you use the gallery, it can start to download again from the SD card and just remember everything that I was watching before. Once it's found it, and you can manipulate the image, set it as your backdrop, you know, do whatever you wish to it. So that was a brief demonstration of the Since Money Licorice Tablet device. And it's from us here, and let me just take my SD card out, make sure I've done this very thoroughly. There you go, you can take it out that way. So thank you for watching, it's been Andre Roberts from sincemani.co.uk showing you how to watch movies and watch, look at pictures and manipulate them and copy them across using an Android tablet device. Thank you for watching.